My most popular video is a video talking about how to be nonchalant, but I gotta be real with y'all, man. That shit is low-key just a coping mechanism for uh, something. Probably just loneliness. I've been nonchalant for a long time, bro, but I don't want to be nonchalant forever. The videos that I be seeing about how to be nonchalant and why you're being nonchalant, and even in my video, the why for it was wrong. You shouldn't be trying to be nonchalant to get shorties. You should be nonchalant if that's what your natural personality is. I don't think anybody's natural personality is nonchalant. I'm sure some people's are. When you're a little kid, what little kid is really nonchalant? The one that's being nonchalant as a coping mechanism. They don't even know they're being nonchalant. They're just being quiet. Most likely because they had emotionally abusive parents. Parents that didn't let them talk slash talk back. When your parents are constantly telling you not to talk back, you just end up not talking as much. You end up not being as expressive. You end up holding in your emotions. That just becomes your normal subconsciously. Being nonchalant is a cover up for a lack of confidence, to be honest. I just realized two years ago that I was a uh, not not confident, but I wasn't as confident as I wanted to be. A lot of times I won't speak. I care too much about what other people think. You could play it off as, oh, I'm just chill, I'm just nonchalant. But it's like, nigga, you're just scared. You're just scared to talk. You should never feel like you can't speak. Don't don't just interrupt people when they're speaking or be rude or a dickhead. If someone is interrupting you or if you just want to say something, you should just say it. That's how people are that had parents that respected them. But most parents see their children as less than them because of that's how their parents were, right? So the kid ends up being less confident than they should be. They bow down to authority without question. Essentially, they can never reach their full potential. Like, I suffer from that. I find myself not wanting to speak sometimes, and I know it's just a lack of confidence. Yeah, I want to say something, but I'm just like, eh, whatever. I'm working on it. Noticing it is the first step. I don't want to be nonchalant forever. I really don't. I want to say what's on my mind. It's funny too, because the days that I do be feeling confident and I'm saying everything, I can see in people's eyes, they're like, you're not supposed to be talking this much. I can feel the energy. If you're normally the person that doesn't say too much in your friend group or in your work space, and then one day you're just talking a lot, they will look at you like, why are you, well, who do you think you are? That's the immediate response, and it's crazy. I've noticed that a number of different times. Fuck everybody that tries to make their perception of you what you are. If one day you want to talk a lot, talk a lot. Fuck with them niggas thinking. Forget that. Be yourself, even if yourself changes from day to day, because we're human. We're not just one mood. That's why we have a spectrum of emotion. Not supposed to be the same every single day. Don't get caught up trying to be too nonchalant. Express yourself, say what you want to say, be confident. That's what y'all really should be reaching for, how to be confident. Maybe the next video will be how to be confident. Once I, uh, once I feel like I'm being confident every day, I'll make that video. Love y'all boys.